Sean, just talk about your spring and how it's going for you personally. Uh, it's just going great, man. It's uh, you know, it's fun getting you know to go out there and go against uh, Coach Muschamp's defense. Uh, you know, we're just getting better, going out there grinding every day. So it's it's been pretty fun. Who specifically on the defense is impressed you that you've gone against? Uh, the whole D-line, pretty much. You know, all those guys are coming out to work every day. Uh, Russell, uh, you know, Andrews, uh, you know, Munchavis, obviously. You know, all those guys are coming out and they're working hard. Based off of Carl? Yeah, yeah, we, fa we faced off a little bit. Uh, you know, he, he looks better than, you know, when he was playing. You know, he, he's really hard working, so, you know, I'm not surprised at all the, uh, pro the progression that he has. How, how different is this spring for you now that you've got a, a year of, of starting and being that guy under your belt? How, how different do you feel this spring? Uh, it's very different. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm taking a whole new approach. Uh, you know, just you know, sometimes I go back and look at film from last year, and you know, just you know, check out the things I need to get better at. So I've been working, you know, before spring practice, and I plan on working this summer on you know things that I can get better at. What's the biggest thing you saw when you when you watched? What, what's a couple of things that you said? Okay, I, I've got to get better at this. Uh, mainly footwork, uh, you know, and, you know, I mean, some of it, you know, it's just experience and stuff like that. Like, last year was my first year, so, you know, that's something, getting adjusted to the speed of the game and, uh, you know, just being more more physical than last year. You kind of, Greg Robinson kind of felt with some of his first year as a starter and then obviously with the second player pick. You kind of see yourself in a similar position like that position to make a big, big step up like you did? Uh, no doubt, you know I, I, I um, you know, talked to Greg about that sometimes. Uh, you know, he he had his first year, and then you know he did his thing his second year. So, you know, obviously, you know I'm trying to you know follow the same footsteps. Uh, you know, last year obviously was my first year, so this year I'm just trying to go out there and you know let just let it all go. You know, work on things in the summer, uh, this spring, and uh, you know use it on the field next year. Is there any game or matchup that kind of motivates you? Anything from last year that Beyonce, all right, I need to improve on this. Is there any one incident, one game, one matchup that just sticks out and you say, man, I, that one really sticks with you? Um, you know, I, 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 had, I had some good games, some bad games last year. So I would say all of the bad games I had, uh, you know, Texas and them, where I had penalties, uh, Georgia. Uh, you know, that, that, those are like definitely films that I've been looking at now to, you know, try to work on this year. I, I, when you Look back, it's been a long time since you, since you uh, signed with Auburn uh, back when. Or, uh, is, is it kind of amazing to you that it's, that it's come to, finally come to this point? Yeah, man, I mean, it's, it really is crazy. I was actually thinking about that the other day, uh, you know, where I am and, you know, where I was about five years ago. Uh, so, you know, just to be here at Auburn is a blessing. Uh, you know, to be playing football, you know, that's, that's just the, the extra, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, getting a, getting a degree. And, uh, you know, being able to go out there and compete with my uh, my teammates. Would, would you want, would you like this beer last year? Uh, I would like to stay as long as long as I can. Uh, you know, I got another year after this year, so you know, I I love to stay as long as I can. How do you feel about eight days so far? What, are, what do you think eight day means to the team? Just to show people what you guys done in the spring. Uh, I think uh, a day is uh, especially big for the fans. Uh, you know, just to you know, let them come in and see you know how uh, how much better we've gotten. Uh, you know, just like a sneak peek of you know what what to look forward to this this uh, fall. Getting a lot of our curious, especially because of Coach Mush, Coach, Coach Mush campaign here, um, especially on defense. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm still curious, trying to see what else he's going to put in. You know, for the defense. So. Uh, you know, he he's a great coach. Uh, you know, a lot of people are going to be here, you know, just to see the new defense. So, you know, it, it should be something to look forward to. Sean, the, the defense 3-4, three, 4-3, four, four, three, kind of giving you some different looks. How, how helpful has that been for you guys as an offensive line? Very helpful. Uh, you know, we, we look at those games uh, throughout the year, 4-3 uh, odd. So, uh, you know, it's already clicking in our mind, you know, how to – what protection or, you know, what assignments we need to have for those defenses. What has it been like having Alex back some to work beside you? They kind of developed chemistry there because obviously he was out all last season, so you never worked with him. Uh, it's great having him back. Uh, you know, he's a he's a, he's a big leader on the offensive line. Uh, he's a guy that you know has not, a lot of knowledge and a lot of experience, so he can help a younger guy out. And uh, you know, he's he's a competitor.